Hello and welcome to my channel. So to start this mermaid look off I mix the Pro Performance HD Airbrush Makeup by MAC and I mix the colour Pure White and a tiny bit of the colour Marine Ultra to create a really pale look. The airbrush I'm using in this tutorial is by Din Air. I do have a video all about it and I'll link that in the description down below. But if you do not have an airbrush do not worry you could use normal face paint I really recommend the ones by Snazaroo and to add any colour later on you can use some eyeshadows. To make the contour very mermaid-esque I mix the pure white paint, the landscape green paint and also the high def cyan, cyan paint? Oh no, I don't know how to say that word. But it makes this really gorgeous turquoisey colour and I put that across my forehead and to contour my cheekbones. I also spray this along my jawline and then all the way down my neck. I wanted to make the contour really wide around my nose and my eyes so I actually joined the contour up to my eyebrows and covered my eyebrows. I then wanted to make my nose look really buttony so I sprayed around the tip of my nose and then a bit over it as well. Then I'm contouring my chest so I contour around my collarbone so they really stand out and then I also cover my ears as well so everything looks together. Now it's time to create some veins. So I mixed some red face paint in with some black face paint so it wasn't as bright and I put it on a really really thin nail art brush. I got this from Claire's and if you've seen any of my other tutorials you'll probably recognise it because I use it quite a lot. I decided to do the veins around my eyes, my nose, my mouth and a bit around my neck. To make my eyes look a little bit more infected I got a really dark red eyeshadow and this is actually from the Barry M Fall in Love palette and I put that on a blending brush and put it all over my lid and underneath my eyes. I then get a bright pink eyeshadow on a bigger fluffy brush and just tap it around the veins on my eyes. I also tapped a little bit on the veins everywhere else on my face and my neck. Once I've done that I get that shadow and I tap it all around my lips and then get some red face paint and put it on the inner side of my lips and just tap it around to make it look like blood. I then mix the red face paint with the black face paint to make it a lot darker and applied a lot more around my lips. I then applied the YSL Mascara Volume Effect Faux Seals Mascara and this is in the shade 5 and it's a really dark red colour. I then applied the MAC Cold Power Eye Pencil and this is in Feline in my waterline. Then to finish this look off I put on this wig that I'll try and link below and then and I also had a shell necklace and bracelet that I attached to it. So this is the final look. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. If you liked it, make sure to hit that thumbs up button. And if you don't want to miss any more of my Halloween tutorials coming this month, make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell. If you are looking for more Halloween inspiration, make sure you're following me on my Instagram page as I'm uploading a Halloween look every day on there. My handle is brook.l underscore and it will be linked in the description down below as well as all the products that I used in this video. Thank you so 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 much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!